Hey guys, welcome back to another second channel video here on my personal channel. Wait, that's the same thing. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to another second channel video, the channel where I talk about anything I want. Today we have an interesting topic that I didn't think I would have to make because, you know, I... Let's start from the beginning. Let's start from the beginning, ladies and gentlemen. Let's start from the beginning. So, twitch.tv. I don't like the website. I don't like it. I think I got a bad look on the website since the beginning of time because, you know, it was the main streaming source. So obviously where there's good, there's going to be a lot of bad. And since I cover morbid topics, I think I just got a really bad look on Twitch. That's how I'll justify my mindset on it. That doesn't go to say that the developers or I guess the, yeah, I guess, is that the word? The website developers? Whatever the proper word is, the people behind the scenes on at Twitch are just very out of touch. And I dislike that. I remember my first ounce of not liking Twitch was when uh, people would call the the Twitch employees, the Twitch staff, uh, simp's, because they would ban, they would ban men, and women would do some cr crazier stuff. But it's because it's a woman, nah, she gets a pass. That's when my hate for Twitch started, and then um, YouTube streaming became a thing, and that's when I would stream on my second channel or this second channel, I guess. You know, it was going pretty good. I wouldn't stream that often, but. It was pretty cool. The only thing was, like, again, no, no crazy viewership. Not that I was trying to be a full-time streamer, but it's fun. Streaming is fun when you do have something to do with your audience, and it's uh, intimate. You get to really just talk to them, you know? It's pretty cool. It's very direct. The thing with YouTube is that you're competing with YouTube thumbnails, you know? So if I'm making a video, or if I'm streaming, right? Today we're playing Happy Wheels, whatever. There's a Mr. Beast thumbnail right there. You know, like, you're gonna lose viewers. That's why I don't like YouTube streaming. That's like the con of YouTube streaming. I hope YouTube YouTube has something in the works to make it better for streamers. Imagine if like YouTube.tv became its own website and that is it basically would be a Twitch site clone. Dude, that would be hard as fuck. But no, it's YouTube streaming combined with YouTube videos. Bro, they're going to leave my fucking stream and go watch Mr. Beast, you know? And I don't like the fact that you have to make a thumbnail for every YouTube uh stream kick.com kick.com my favorite up until i'm about to say now but i'm you're gonna see why kick.com that became the place to like be able to cuss and not get banned the better uh pay rates um uh, i think it was like a what is it 90 10 split 95 5 split whatever it was i'm not in it for the money so i wasn't paying attention to the money part i was paying attention to the fact that we got a new streaming service that wasn't twitch or youtube i was just happy uh, of course, out of Twitch or YouTube, I would I was already on YouTube. I thought YouTube was great, but man, um, Kick really was that savior. Like Kick was that savior for me. I was like, okay, I could stream now. Like I could actually stream and and not be a hypocrite if I hop on Twitch because I've talked so much shit about Twitch. Rightfully so. I think I think we all know on the internet by now, Twitch doesn't have a good reputation either. You can hate on kick streamers all you want, but Twitch staff is horrible. <laughs> That's what I want to talk about, the kick streamers. The reputation kick has is just the outcasts, the, the people that got banned, the bullies. They went to kick and I thought it was getting better when they got Rage, XQC. Aiden's already pretty controversial. And then the whole thing with the gambling thing, which personally I don't care about. I don't care. Just go ahead and tick the, the gambling thing. And if you get mad that Kick is owned by Stake, I think you got some bigger stuff to worry about in life. Amazon owns Twitch. I'm pretty sure Amazon's a horrible company too. But I think it's just people reading too deep into that. So I didn't, I really don't care about that. You can cancel me if you want for that. But it's just the, the identity that Kick has so far. It's been, I don't know how long it's been, maybe uh, nine months that Kick has been out. And, you know, the prominent dude on there is Aiden. It's Aiden Ross. And as much as I do watch, tune into his stream sometimes, you know, I don't watch full streams. Aiden being the face of Kick, just, it's, it's a lot. Like, it's not Aiden alone. It's Aiden, Neon, I believe Jack Doherty now, Vitaly now, and it's like, this isn't me. You know, that's not, that's not me, nor am I an IRL streamer, but I, I, I just can't be associated with these people. Entertaining, yes, but for the wrong reasons, I guess. That's not me, man. I'm a sit down, I sit down, we react to some stuff. I really liked Kick because I could react to uh, fights. Like, we would watch street fights on Kick. So, I don't know if I'm going to do a last one. I, I would hope to do a last, like, reacting to fights video on Kick. And we were watching Spongebob, you know, for copy. I, I don't know if that got patched, like, the copyright thing. But I was watching full episodes of Spongebob at one point. 
the most amount of viewers I got on there was 400 or 400. So uh, I'll keep that in mind. So the question is, where will I move to? Remember, streaming is my side thing. I'm, a, I'm mainly a YouTuber. Y'all know the new video got ha half a million views in one day. So we doing good on YouTube as the main channel. If you're wondering why I don't stream on the main channels, because that would be too much pressure. I don't want to. No, I'm just not going to do that. So I would stream on the second. So where would I move to? Would I move to Twitch where the staff is out of touch? Would I move to YouTube where you're competing with YouTube thumbnails so you get less uh, viewer retention or viewers at all? Or Rumble. I'm not doing Rumble, by the way. <laughs> where there's political figures and it's oh, it's just a dead site. Or Kick. Would I stay on Kick? As much as I wanted Kick to win, I am not staying on Kick. There's a reason this video is being made. First, I'll let my lights tell you. So, we're going to... That's right. TikTok streaming. TikTok streaming is actually really good nowadays. No, nah, I'm just kidding. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. We are going to twitch.tv. I can't believe I'm saying that. Oh my God. I hate that fucking website. I hope to get a good look on it. You know, you got to try everything. You got to try things out in life. I, Tuv, am moving to twitch.tv for streaming purposes. And my at on there is Tuffington underscore. You can find it in the link in the description. This is heavy for me for being a really hard-headed person on, on Twitch, but... Uh, the identity for kick streamers is um, horrible, and I don't want to be associated with that. I can't take it anymore. Like every other day, there's a neon clip, there's a Vitaly clip, there's a kick streamer does blank, and it's like, bro, all right, I, I don't want to be associated with that. And yes, I'd rather deal with some old heads at the Twitch staff not knowing what to do with the company than an identity that I don't belong in. That's just me, bruh. And it's not like I'm an edgy streamer either. Like I would do the, the reacting to, to fights streams for fun you know it's not like that's my reputation the fight guy like nah bro like we're gonna still it's the same thing i'm gonna go make music on stream react to songs that i have already made um look at discord memes watch youtube videos play video games again i don't stream that often so i don't have a schedule i'm just saying you should go follow it you get you see that notification that pops up tuffington underscore went live you go oh that's my dog. Let me go check him out. The streams won't change. Um, not that I stream that often. I know, I'm, I know. Why am I making a big deal out of this if I don't stream? I don't know. I think it's worthy of a, of a second channel video. I feel like I've been really loud this video. Let me tone it down. Thank you guys for sticking by me. Thank you guys. Thank you to the people that uh, knew Kick was spelled K-I-C-K and not people were like, why are you streaming on Kick Messenger? Weren't you talking trash about it a few videos ago? Bro. Y'all so out of touch, y'all didn't even realize a new streaming service like came up like on the internet. And uh, shout out to the people that went, made kick accounts for me. You know, uh, every fucking day I would stream, I would get a fucking a, a text in the, in the chat talking about, I made a kick account just for you. And I thought that was cool. Like seriously, that's so ride or die of you. Thank you so much. Going back to like the uh, streaming on kick and like, for example, Sapnap got like, almost canceled by his fucking audience or his, his audience still hates that he streams on kick first of all thank you guys for not being such an uptight audience i would not be able to uh like my job if i had an audience like the dream smp or any of those like almost how do i i don't know but very very uptight fan bases and i love it i love that i'm i don't know how many times i've said this but i am bisexual am i gonna regret saying that for the fucking third time on video but i am not um at least what people think someone from the lgbt represents i'm not an uptight dude i'll make edgy jokes and i'll love who i love at the same time but like bro yeah i just please you guys don't become the uptight fan base that i fucking hate uh i'd fucking i just retire at that point every company has something bad with them including twitch including youtube and google everything so i'd rather stream where i don't care about the money if i cared about the money I, there's a chance i could have stayed on kick and by the way i don't have any deals i'm not a big streamer to get any deals um but i doubt twitch would give me a deal based on how i'm even talking about them i just need somewhere to go <laughs> like that's literally it maybe maybe i'll end up liking them you know um i hope i hope i do, I hope I do. but yeah Thank you guys for being an awesome, not uptight fan base. I really appreciate that. Thank you for being such uh, a breath of fresh air. Uh, it doesn't go unnoticed. Thank you guys so much. And make sure to go watch the new channel video. Make sure to uh, buy yourself some Earl slippers. I'm currently wearing mine. I know his nose is dirty. That's because I wear them a lot. But make sure to go buy them. They're only $15 at EarlDoesn'tExist.com. And we also have some Stop Loving Me vinyls. I make music as well, in case you guys didn't know. 
the best YouTuber musician out right now. That's basically it. And uh, I'll see you guys next time I upload.